Right here we've got the wind goo, which sounds like uh, some kind of pill that gets rid of farts, but it's the wind goo M20, which is a very premium looking e-scooter. It's got a nice little <coughs> bell that's kind of calming. Front and rear disc brakes, I think. Yep, disc at the front. Is that disc at the back? Oh, it might be like a... Oh no, there's a disc, yeah, disc. I can't, uh, I can't get that now. There you go, disc brake at the back. Um, what makes this difference to all the normally commuter scooters I've had is it's rear wheel drive, if you can see that. It's the rear wheel that's got the motor in it. 350 watts and top speed, 25 kilometers per hour, which is, you know, the standard legal speed. Couldn't find a way to unlock it. Did find a way to put zero start on, but if anyone knows how to unlock the speed, let me know. So let's take it out. So first things first, how does it cope up the good old hill by my house? Right, it's got cruise control, so that's just kicked in. It's on level one. I'm going to bump it up to, we're going 10 kilometers per hour, which is obviously terrible. Woo. Okay, cruise control came off when I uh, went up to level two. So what we're doing now, feels pretty slow. It's got suspension. It's got air filled tires, which is nice. Um, the kind of honeycomb tires that you get are generally very, very bumpy. It's got a curved, nice curved deck. Okay, that's that's two. I'm gonna go up to three. It's gonna start. Get out of cruise control. Let's get up now. Oh, something's in there. 21 kilometers per hour. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go on the road. I think today. Maybe the wrong side of the road. Right. So, um, 23, 24. There's three sit pit speed settings. Oh, it's gone to 26. That's, that's weird. Oh, 25. You see, oh, it loses, it cuts power as soon as it gets to uh, above 25 miles an hour. That's weird. There's someone on a little stunt scooter. So, so we'll see what goes down the hill. It's really smooth, actually. I quite like the, uh, how it feels with the airfield tyres. Airfield tyres and suspension is quite luxurious for a commuting scooter. So, cruise control is automatic. Let's test out a brake. Which brake's that? And that's the rear brake. Can I skid? No skidding. No skidding. Front brake? What's that like? Okay. I should try and back together. I'm glad that you can put zero start in. There doesn't seem to be a way. Let's try brake brakes. Yeah, not bad. Doesn't seem to be a way to change the speed. I couldn't see if there was an app. I don't think there's an app. Let's go down here. Yeah, quite often you get an app and in the app you can increase the maximum speed as with the uh, iScooter i9. Some, some scooters just come with a higher speed automatically. This one, they seem to be kind of trying to play it legal although you know these scooters currently illegal that felt nice going up there then let's slow down oh it smells nice right there's a Chinese takeaway let's get back onto the road let's get in let's try the good old canal path I always go down Let me know if you're watching and you've seen a few videos <laughs> before. You're getting bored of the canal path. I um, I kind of like it because it means I know exactly what it should feel like with different scooters, etc. I quite this suspension is nice. I don't think the suspension at the front. Right, there's no one behind me. Is there a car coming? Is there a car coming? No car coming. Good. Whee! It's, it's very, it's all very sedate. 
because you're on a scooter and you're standing up it kind of feels slower automatically compared to say the little bike that I've tried the uh, DYU e-bike I hope I'm recording I'm recording aren't I I've been saying all that for nothing anyway, let's just take yes yeah, recording that's good yeah these bits if I didn't have zero start it'd be really annoying Well, yeah, this goes exactly the same speed as the DYUS2, a small, tiny e-bike that thinks it's an e-scooter. Check out that video. But because I'm higher up, it feels slower. I mean, that, that allowed me to get... You can go faster than 25, but you have to go down hills and things like that. So, um... Slow right down there as people... Yeah... <laughs> evil can evil e scooter can evil making fun of me they are it's because I have a helmet on but better safe than sorry always wear your helmet ah oh, it, it feels loads better than um, the other ones it's so comfortable this might be my most comfortable scooter. Obviously the drawback to uh, airfield tyres is you could get a puncher. Let's go over this mud. How's it do? It's got a really kind of like steady acceleration. Here are the bumps. So yeah, this is definitely not going to be a speed test video because he just does not want me to go. Right, steady, steady. Oh, wow. Wow, that was impressive. It's, um... Oh, here's more. Let's try these. So these big bumps here, these are always like killing me. Wow. It just... Gallops over them. Let's try it over the grass. Can I come past, please? Thank you. Thanks. I'm so polite, aren't I? Right. Uh, don't fall off. I right, one-handed e-scooter in. It's not the same as being on a bike, is it? Oh, bikes. Kids on bikes. I'm going on the left. <laughs> Thanks. Right, let's go. Cruise control. Cruise control. Let's go into the bridge. I am so impressed with this. Remember the uh, the wheels are... Actually, how big are these wheels? I think they're 10 inches. I think it's 36 volts, I think. I'll put something on the screen if I'm wrong. 10 amp hour. I'm pretty sure I read that. I could be wrong. What's going on here? <laughs> yeah, I'm so impressed with how comfortable this is. I've never come this far before on the scooter. I always turn around, but they've got this new path here. You might have seen it in some of the videos. Oh, off road. Come on. How can we f uh, can we get up to 25 on this? I am 100 kilograms ish. Let's dip down a bit so I can kind of get a better sense of speed. The battery's showing three bars. It was fully charged. Don't know if that's true. Or if it's just because of accelerating. Ooh. But they get me home. I've done 3.2 kilometres. I mean, this is, this is quite a nice speed, to be fair. Like, you don't... If you were using a scooter to go somewhere, like to work or whatever, you shouldn't really be going faster than this. And obviously the, the faster you are, the more likely you are to die if you fall off. 
you're only a bit faster than a bike you know your, your average bike bikes can go a lot faster than this if there's a you know someone who's highly trained rider on it this is nice i'm going along the canal on a nice thursday evening lovely we're going to see if we can get up the hill on the, up here then i'll go back there's the ducks I'm so glad they made this path. First time I came down here on a scooter, it was all mud. I felt like I was slowing down then, but I'm still going 25. There's the hill. Let's see if we can get up the hill. I'm having a bit of a run up. I'll, I'll slow down a bit. Slow down. And go. Jugga, 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 jugga. Nope. Oh, no. Didn't quite make it up there. I'm sure if I was lighter it could. And off we go. That's the pigeon. You know what? I'm going to try and get a thumbnail here. With the ant. <coughs> oh. I'll do. It's good to have something there. Oh, oh I've left the stand on. That's dangerous. There we go. Have I gone a different way? I don't usually go this way, but... Oh, I know where I am. No, I don't. Right, I'm using another path. How do I end up down here? I need to get right. Somehow. Is that the path? That's the path, isn't it? Is it? I'm lost, man. Right, I can do this. Oh, come on, it's all right. Oh, it's uh, slow down for some reason. Why is that? Does it need help? It's got four bars. Hmm. Okay, I know we're in there. But this is not working. You can see that. Cruise control, 13 kilometers per hour. It's broken. Huh. It's in some sort of emergency mode or something. Let's um turn it off. Turn it off, turn it on again. It's got Bluetooth. Maybe it has got an app. Okay, okay, it's back. I have no idea what happened then. But it has got some sort of rev counter on it. Once I've got through these bars, we'll have a look. Whence? From whence? Once. My ribs are in the oven. Not my actual ribs. Ribs I'm going to eat. Come on up the hill. Come on up there. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Feels a bit underpowered at the moment. Something's going on. Mm-hmm. Always doing the thing again. What is happening? At Morrison's. I should buy rice. Right, I'll turn it off and on again. It might be overheating because it's in the the high gear. I'm in second now. Worst. Oh, oh, there we go. Bit of power. You were doing so well, little scooter. No, you just... Oh, no, back again. He kind of loses power and gains power. Or maybe it's actually... Maybe it's because this one is the... 
the lower power setting so it has a different max speed see that rev counter can you see that it's got it's like white at the moment sometimes it goes red possibly because it's a 350 peak power and maybe it's like it was doing it too much it's getting stressed out it's like get your fat ass off me And then 20 kilometers per hour now it's going to the red 21 kilometers per hour i think it's getting its mojo back a little bit i don't usually go this far on a scooter oh that's not burning Ooh, you fell off the thing come on come on come on I've gotta say i'm not overly impressed so far now what was that noise Come on. 15. Okay, 17. Well, I've got to say. Oh, because oh, I've turned it off and on again, I so. No, that's the power. I need to get to the Odo. We'll find out how much I've done so far. Right, I can access this. I think if I press both of those, like that, press that once. Oh dear. there we go. I've done five kilometers. Turn that back out. Go again. Oh, no, turn this up so you can see. I just want to get back now. Oh, a little bit of little punch there 23 24 25 he's got his power back again well apart from it being really really comfortable nice looking nice grips nice chunky feeling throttle it's it wouldn't fill me with confidence if I had to use it every day based on this little tiny first impressions where I've done barely five miles on it. Well, it's about three miles in it. Around this corner. Try not to get rested. I don't think it likes me. Yep, 12. Come on, give it a bit of help. It's basically going as if the battery's running out and yet the battery has just been fully charged. Come on, get me home before the ribs are cooked. And off the road. Right, this is annoying, I'm gonna turn it off and on again. <laughs> Old man on a bike going past me. Okay. Mm. Oh, there we go. It's back again. Back again. Hello. Still only going 16. Wow. 16 kilometers per hour. It feels very, very slow. Yep. This is embarrassing. This is very embarrassing why are you doing this the 20 still tires are nice slightly downhill here come on nearly there so i'm gonna say i mean i'm nearly back on my house so i'm gonna say um, if you got something out of this video, then don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more scooter tests. I'm going to be reviewing this fully, properly, hopefully, soon. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to want me to, based on its performance at the moment. Oh, oh, 24. Because it's very temperamental, it's extremely temperamental. So, if you want to get a really, really comfortable temperamental scooter, then my first impressions is, this is what you want. Otherwise, maybe try something else. That's it for the EVRC. Take care of yourself.
and ride safe.